Hey fighting game fans, what is up? It is I, FGF Chris. We're going to be playing through the arcade mode of Street Fighter V Arcade Edition as Jury Han from Street Fighter IV and Charlie Nash in Street Fighter V. So let's kick some ass and take some names. Three rounds, normal difficulty, sounds good to me. Alright. Now, Jury is the very first evil Taekwondo practitioner to ever grace a fighting game. She is a really cool character. Very dark and sadistic. I love it. So, we're going to kick her butt. We'll use the Nostalgia costume. And we'll uh, use her V-Trigger Feng Shui Engine Alpha, which is my favorite uh, V-Trigger of hers. So, let's do it. Oh, it looks like I'm fighting Ibuki first from Street Fighter 3. All right. Sign me up for this shit. Let's do it. We're fighting at the Kanzuki Beach, which is a really awesome stage. It's very, very beautiful looking. You'll see what I mean. All right, Ibuki. Take my Kim Kaf one kicks. <laughs> Yeah, I kick you from behind. So I'm a badass chick. Nice. KO, bitch. You and your kunai throwing knives aren't, aren't gonna stop me at all. You're done, kid. Got the Kim Kafwan kicks. Oh yeah. Yeah, take that, Abooks. <laughs> I love the beach stage. I love the like waves crashing onto the beach. It looks so cool. Definitely a very aesthetic stage to this game. Alright. Cammy or Dalsim? We'll fight Cammy, why not? She is um I don't know. She's more fun to fight against than Dalsim. Dalsim's just a weird old guy with stretchy limbs. Now, one thing that's, I kind of found fascinating about Yuri's, Yuri's design is that she looks very spidery. Like, most of her look resembles a spider. I mean, her brawl looks like a spider, in a way. And fun thing about me is, like, fun little fact, I'm deathly afraid of spiders. I have arachnophobia like nobody's business. But for some reason, Yuri looks really sexy to me with the whole spider theme going on. So, yeah, it kind of cancels out my arachnophobia a little bit when I play her. Pretty far out, right? Gotta love Jury's Rekkas. Perfect KO! Nice. I really mixed that up pretty well. Look at all these... <laughs> look at all these, like, British people, like, bobbing their heads and crap. <laughs> it's funny. Ow, bitch! Stop it, Cammy. No one likes that. You know, fuck it. Oh shit. Time to use a Feng Shui engine. It's one way to mix it up. Look at all the guys jamming out in the background. They're like headbanging and shit. You gotta love the little details that this game has. It's pretty cool. Ken or Chung Li? I think we'll fight... Oh, shit. 
We'll fight Chung Lee. Why not? Chunners. Yeah, she's spidery as hell, but very attractive. Spidery girl. It's kind of neat. I think we're fighting at Kanzuki Beach again. Which is a cool stage, I'm not complaining. Yeah, get lost. Okay, that's it, you fucking... You asked for it. God damn. Try and do that combo and it keeps failing. There we go. Take that, Thunder Thighs. Her legs are big as my torso, it's ridiculous. And go to hell! Perfect KO! Man, I'm kicking total ass with her. Yay, I got 87,320 points. Alright, Dulcim or Guile? Fuck it, we'll fight Guile. Why not? Take down this military jarhead. It's like I could balance books on my head. Because <laughs> I have a flat haircut. I do not like, I, I still do not like Guile's hairstyle. You know, I've been playing this game, I've been playing Street Fighter since 1991 for the Sega Genesis crap. And, um, Guile's hair I just couldn't get into. I'm like, eh, it looks kind of stupid and silly. It's very impractical, too, you know. Alright, Guile. Yeah, the normal mode for the arcade is kind of on the easy end of things. It's not that difficult to beat. But like the arcade modes of any fighting game, it starts off easy and then progressively gets harder. So, by the time we get to the last few characters, it's going to be a little bit more difficult. That and I'm just really good with Jury. <laughs> All right. There we go, I love that combo. Okay. Oh wow, now he's stepping it up, shit, all right. Ah, god damn. All right, guys. Sick of getting a, the beat down on him, so he has to fight me hard. Hey, look at sunrise. That's kind of neat. It's sunset, like nighttime. Now it's like daytime. Now I love the transition of like dawn in this game. Vega or Balrog? We'll fight Vega. Why not? Let's give Vega a chance to kick my butt if he can. I wonder what stage we're going to fight at with Vega. Okay, I think it's the train station stage. Hey, he's got his, um... He got his, like, brown hair in this. That's kind of cool. I guess in Street Fighter 4 he did have brown hair. 
Neat. Tim Kafwan kicks. Oh, fuck you, Vega. He's being a little tough. All right. Oh, fuck. Ow, bitch! Okay, see, this is what I mean. It gets harder as you go on. Oh, man, ouch. Made quick work of me. Hey, you're Spanish, not from Switzerland, you weirdo. Doing the yodeling crap. You know, fuck this. Take that, Vega. Take down half your health. Ow! Crap! I need to block more. And he is good at the poke, shit. Gotcha. All right. Final round, Vega, let's do it. Oh, fucking A, ouch. Okay, I need to use a V-trigger, come on. Oh, fucking A. Oh, man, he kicked my ass. I was being a little bit sloppy of Cherry in that round. All right, whatevs. Okay, we'll have to fight him again, it looks like. You know what? Just to mix it up a little bit, I think I'm going to choose Jury's uh, schoolgirl outfit as her uh, alternate costume. Just to mix it up a little bit. Add a different aesthetic to the game. All right. God damn it, Vega. Shit. Him and his pokes. All right, Jerry Han, school uniform, and she looks badass. She kind of looks like she belongs in like the Batman universe. She's got the whole Harley Quinn thing going on. All right, Vega, time to die this time. All right, Vega. Time to go down. All right. Fun fact, Jury is 25 years old according to the Street Fighter 4 storyline. So that means that she's dressed up like a schoolgirl for no reason. <laughs> I mean, she's like seven years too late to uh, dress like a schoolgirl, <laughs> you know? It's pretty far out. There, I kicked his ass good that round. All right, round two. This Harley Quinn looking schoolgirl's gonna kick your ass. All right. Take my flips. Shit. There we go. Come on, come on, Gavega.
There, that was a lot better than the first round against him. Jeez. Alright, Harley Quinn jury. Yeah, she looks like a total Batman villain. Alright, Cody or Ryu? Let's fight Cody, why not? Alright. Hi, I'm Cody. I'm a boring asshole. <laughs> He's got his, um, his prison uniform on from Street Fighter 4. That's kind of neat. I like that. He looks so sad. Look at his eyes. They're like, please don't, please just kill me. I'm tired of life. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Poke your ass. Crap, ah, I can't grab him. Trip your ass. <laughs> Kick you in the back of your head. Please hit. Good. Perfect KO. Nice. That's awesome. Take that, coders. As I flip around and kick a billion times. I got 66,770 points. Sakura or Sagat? You know what? Fuck it. We'll fight Sakura. Why not? Scott's a prick. I don't want to mess with him. Scott and his giant, like, tiger uppercuts and crap. Yay, we're going to Japan! My favorite place. All my cool toys are from Japan. Ah, uh, alright. Oh, we're fighting at um, Sakura's stage from Street Fighter Alpha. That's kind of cool. Sakura's pretty cute. I, I like Sakura. She's adorable. Come on, let's go to school, Sakura. I'll be your teacher. Rah, rah. <laughs> oh, crap. And she's not pulling off the stops. Alright. Nice. Kick from behind. Take that, Sakura. I'll sock you. Sock you, Ra. Ha ha ha. Get it? Crap, ow. Bitch! Please connect, good. <laughs> I, I hit her foot, and that's what knocked her unconscious. <laughs> Just like real life, right? Good job, Jerry. You're cool. You're so cool, Jerry. Bison. Now we fight the final boss, and he's going to be an asshole prick. He's probably going to be pretty tough. 
I don't know. The rest of the characters are relatively easy in a normal mode, but M. Bison, he steps it up at the end. Secret Air Base. Time to fight Bison. Ah, oh, man. Yeah, like, all the characters are pretty easy until you get to Bison, then you really deal with heavy shit. Alright, let's try to kick this evil dictator's ass. Alright, Mike Bison, Michelo Bison. Let's do this. I'm not bowing down over shit, dude. You're a freak. So we're gonna kick your ass. Cut. He has like mad combos, I notice. Haha, tricked you. Okay, ouch. Got you. Alright. Round two, let's do it. Ow, bitch! Shit, ow! V trigger, do it! Feng Shui time! God damn it, if I can get out of it. Ah, oh, fuck you, dude! Oh my god, he combo mastered my ass. And I blast off, holy crap. Okay, this time I'm not messing around. You're fucking dead. Okay, we're gonna do the jumping trip. <laughs> cheap method here. Shit! Shit. Shit! Get out of that! Okay. Let's all come down to this. Shit. Yes! Oh my god, that was close. Woo! Woo! -hoo -hoo -hoo. All right, so that's how we beat Street Fighter 4. <laughs> Arcade mode. Oh my god, Bison was giving me the business. Alright. So now we'll see the ending um, illustration done by Udon Artist for uh, that did the comics for like Street Fighter and all that. So, yeah. There's me, Jerry Han, kicking Seth, Seth's ass from uh, Street Fighter 4. Seth, fun fact, that guy that's on the ground dying and shit in this picture, he's based off of Seth Killian, one of the producers for Street Fighter 4. Pretty impressive, right? Alright, so now we'll move on to Nash. Thank you for playing. You're welcome. Alright, now on Street Fighter 5 as Charlie Nash. Let's kick some butt. Three rounds, normal difficulty, start game. All right, Charlie Nash is a really interesting character. He uh, he died supposedly in Street Fighter Alpha 2, but he came back as Franken Nash. Look at that! He looks like half Frankenstein, half cool ass Charlie Nash. You know, it works. We we'll use Sonic Move as the V trigger. And we're fighting Rashid on an airplane. <laughs> This stage is so bizarre. It's like, we're going to fight on an airplane, uh, circling a city, and somehow not fall off the plane at all because of, you know, turbulence or airspeed or whatever. <laughs> it's kind of bonkers. Alright, Rashid. Get off my plane! <laughs> Get lost. Damn straight. As I explode your brain with my fist. Alright, 
come throw your ass. As I break your neck. Perfect KO, bitch. Take that to the bank. I suggest you stay down. That's a good suggestion. I suggest you stay down. Get off my plane, asshole. Ow, now he's mixing it up. Okay, this is the Rashid I wanted to fight. Give me a little challenge here. Okay, that's it. Crap. Nice. Double moon slicer, bitch. Take that. You win. Of course I do. I'm Frank and Nash. Alright, who's next? Kareen or Armika? We'll fight Kareen. Miss Little Goldilocks of the game. Yeah, she looks like Goldilocks from, like, the Three Bears or whatever. You know, like, that old nursery rhyme. Except she knows how to fight and she's rich as crap. She has a lot of money. She's a rich little lady. Alright. Kanzuki Estates. Cool. I like Kareen. Kareen has a pretty good moveset. She's very unique to the Street Fighter universe. All right. Round one. Slice you up. Crap, went over her head on that one. Okay, now she's putting up some moves. All right. Shoot you out of a cannon, bitch. Take that. Enjoy the fireworks show. All right. Slice you up, bitch. Ow, bitch. I'm gonna steal your energy. Alright, <laughs> stole your energy. I'm awesome. Ah, oh, you little shit. Come on, bring it. Dare you. Good. Because now I can do this shit. You'll see in a second. Crap. Ah, never mind. I'm trying to pull off his special move, but it didn't work. Getting too old for this shit. Jury or Laura? We'll fight Jury. Why not? Jury's pretty tough. Like, she's got, like, awesome Rekka kicks and Kim Kafwan kicks, too, to mix it up a little bit. Oh, we're fighting in Russia. Cool, alright. All right, fighting in the land of the bears. Like in the background, you'll see a bunch of like dancers and bears doing tricks and shit. It's kind of weird, you know? It works though. Yeah, I don't like, to be honest, I like Yuri's, Jury's design in Street Fighter 4 better than I did in Street Fighter 5. Like the whole spandex thing she's wearing doesn't really suit her too well. That's just my opinion now, you know. So whatever. If you don't agree with it, fuck you. Oh god damn it, Churi. Crap. Oh my god. Okay, that's it. Shit. God damn it. Come on, hit, 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 hit. Oh you bitch! She stopped me right in my tracks. Okay, she's tough. I need to, I need to watch my shit around her. Yep, 
Yeah, ducking's not gonna stop that overhead attack. Oh, I'm being a little bit cheap, but I have to be because Jury is tough. She's not gonna let me have most of these moves. Okay. Good. Phew. Yeah, she's tough. Take a snow nap. <laughs> I'll laugh if she has a snowman on her head. Nah, she doesn't. All right. Ow, bitch! Come on. Okay, that's it. God damn it! I missed again. Okay. Woo! Yeah, she was tough. Alright. First round, she destroyed the hell out of me. I was... Didn't know if I could get out of that. I'm a little bit pissed at myself. I wanted to pull off his super special, but like, she kept like stopping me in my tracks. All right, we'll fight Zeku just for the heck of it. All right. Zeku is a character that um, is rumored to be the original Strider, like you know Strider the video game with uh, Strider Hear You. Zeku's supposed to be the original, according to some fan lore out there. So that's kind of neat. I hope he is. That'd be really awesome to tie in Street Fighter with Strider. That'd be kind of badass. Two Capcom properties right there, too. All right. Hey, Mr. Funky. Slice you up. I love his stage theme, like his uh, fight theme, Zeku. It sounds really like 70s funk. Got like a jazz flute in the background, it's kind of cool. Oh, you're being easy, Zeku. This isn't the Zeku I was expecting to fight. Easy peasy lemon breezy. Yeah, stay down, bitch. I knew you were going to do that. That's why I was like, do this moon slice. Take your energy from you. Okay. You know, we're going to be fancy. <laughs> From behind, like a boss. Yeah, this game, yeah, it, it's it's pretty easy on normal. Um, significantly harder on um, towards the end of the 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 fights that you go through. Like the further you get in, the harder it gets. And we'll fight against Chung Lee. Why not, Miss Chunners? Like, yeah, it's an arcade. It starts off easy, and then it gets harder, and then you fight the boss, and then it gets really hard, supposedly. So, um, yeah. More you know, knowledge is power. Oh, we're fighting in Brazil. Cool. Alright, Chunners. This Thunder Thighs. Go kick your butt. Ow! Yeah, she's not messing around. Crap. 
Oh, fuck you. Okay, there we go. Oh man, she was kicking my butt in that round, shit. I'm gonna have to open up with something strong, I think. Oh, she blocked, shit. Oh, aerial grab, nice. Good job, kid. Shit. Oh, man. Gotta be a little bit cheap with her. Jump and trip method. Shit. Good. Whoo! Alright, final round, Chun Li. Yeah, stay down, you bitch. God damn, ow! That's gonna hurt. That's gonna hurt a lot. Fuck. Yes! Oh my god. Okay, even the score a bit. Oh my god, I had to be really cheap at that last minute of the round because there's no way I could have beat her any other way. I was like, okay, I gotta use the jump kick and the trip method, and it worked. Oh my god, that was close. Bonus stage, alright. I hate these bonus stages, I swear to god. I, I suck ass with the bonus stages, you have no idea. It's very strenuous playing through these. Ugh, fucking bonus stages. All right, here we go. So I gotta break these barrels while getting attacked by this little douchebag. And it's kind of dumb. Oh, God damn it. And as you can see, I get tripped up all the time from it. But God damn it, that's it. You little shit. I'm gonna destroy this guy. Yeah. Get out of here. Yeah, throw your ass. Yeah, take a nap over there, asshole. I'm like, oh man, I lost. <laughs> Jeez. Sakura or Kami? We'll fight Sakura, why not? Alright. I'm gonna sock it to Sakura. Alright, Kanzuki Estates again. This time it's at noon, okay. That's kinda cool. Oh, I totally messed on that. Oh man, ow. Holy crap. She's not messing around. Shit. Oh my god, ow. Oh, fuck. She got me good. At least she's having fun, that's all that matters.
Good. Went over her Hadouken. That's that's a plus. Well, I'll break your neck now. Take that. Good. All right, one round to go. Fucking Sakura. Good, finally. Things are in my favor as I saw your ass in half, kid. Way to kick her butt. Ha <laughs> ha, take a nap. You win. Of course I win. Oh jeez, now I gotta fight a uh, like a mid boss. Like a someone interrupting the match, I guess. It's kinda silly. I think I'm fighting G. Yep, I'm fighting G. Lovely. <laughs> it's kind of goofy, but whatever. Yeah, G is a very interesting character. He's supposed to be like the president of the world. He looks like Uncle Sam cross of Abe Lincoln. It's kind of bizarre. Alright, good for you. Mr. Uncle Sam asshole. God damn. Shit. One more hit. All right, there we go. Not my day. All right. <laughs> Crap, it didn't work. Forgot about the Sonic Booms, I hardly use them. Forgot how handy they come in. Shit, ow. Shit. Good, phew! Take that, Mr. President asshole. Alright, Nikali or Kami? We'll fight Kami, just for the heck of it. Oh man, the loading screens take forever. Alright, Kami. Union Station, cool for me. I am totally down for that. You and your Delta Drive. Yeah, <laughs> take my sonic booms. 
All right. You got a little bit of a poke in, but that's as far as you go, kid. <laughs> All right. Crap. Take that. Gonna kill your ass. I'm sorry, you'd be totally dead after all that shit. There's no surviving that. <laughs> They're all headbanging in the background again. It's a funky train station. Ed or Fang? We'll fight Fang, why not? Mr. Poison User. Yeah, Ed's too much of a prick. I don't want to fight him. Okay, I think we're uh, three away from the final boss. Fang is such a weird-ass character. He's uh, He fights with poison, has long-ass sleeves on his shirt. It's kind of bizarre. We'll kick his ass, so. Round one. Yeah, he's a very slow character, but he's tricky as shit. So you gotta watch your ass around Fang, because he's a trickster. Easy peasy lemon breezy. What the hell? There's like a spaceman getting chap chased around. Fucking weird. Slice your ass up. Come on, put up a fight, Fong. Alright, whatever. Oh, fuck you. Blocked at that moment, but don't block at anything else. <laughs> yeah, normal is kind of an easier difficulty. But they only have three difficulties. They have easy, normal, and hard. And normal is... Normal is a little bit easy. It's kind of normal-ish. But hard isn't that hard, really, either. It's kind of weird. Sagat or Vega? We'll fight... Uh, Vega. Why not? We'll play Vega. Vega and his flamboyant weirdness. Yep. Shadowloo base. We're almost there. Final boss. This is a sub boss before the final boss. Round one. Mr. Flamboyant here. Prick. Yeah, knock your face and your claw off. Yeah, Vega's like the lowest tier character in the game. He's the easiest to beat. Um, he's, he's not going to be super easy in this mode, but typically he's the lowest tier character in competition circles. In the game, he's a little bit better because of C CPU and shit. Gotcha. No escaping that, Vega. You're done. Like a G6, yo. 
<laughs> like your girl in the background firing a machine gun in there. <laughs> Weirdos. At least they're having a good old time. All right, Bison. Final boss. Time to get revenge for him killing me in Street Fighter Alpha 2. Why not? We'll make it quick. I'm going to really do my best against him. Because all the matches before the final boss are kind of easy, kind of normal-ish. But um, M. Bison is... Uh, he's not normal. He's kind of difficult. He's fighting with a psycho power shit. So wish me luck, guys. Keep my fingers crossed. Alright. I'm not bowing to shit. God damn it. Shit. Once he gets a combo and there's no stopping him. Come on. Got him. Phew! That was close. I was being really cheap with the footsies there. Oh my god. Crap, that was a waste. Ow! Ow! Crap. Okay. Come on, hit him. God damn. One more hit. Good, I beat him. Woo, I had to be cheap. He was getting my health down to the wire. All right. So we beat Street Fighter Five and Street Fighter Four today. That's cool. It's the arcade modes of them. I look at the ending. He gave his all, including his life. The weary soldier will drift into internal slumber in the arms of his friend. So, yeah, Nash dies again. Thank you for playing. Thank you for playing. You're welcome. You guys take care. Keep watching my stuff. Peace.